Hey guys. Well, I'm still butchering the 109. I wanted to do the gear up diorama display. It never occurred to me that not all kits are made to do that. So I had to break the wheels in half because I had them glued together with the gear and door. So half the tire, rim and tire fits in there. And with the door, it bothered me you couldn't see any gear, so <laughs> you can see I've split the gear basically in half, notched out the rim and tire so it would fit snug enough down in there that the door will still fit. And of course when I'm filing the door, I overdo it. I had to put a little piece on there which I'll putty in and I've taken this half hour build and turned it into uh, you know, I'll probably get 150 hours worth of enjoyment out of this bad boy by the time it's all done. <laughs> hey just so you guys know I joined not long ago the Temecula Valley Model Club and I joined because well I'm close to the Temecula Valley Model Club. I, from what I remember they've got 90 95 plus members so if anybody's in the area please join and I've given them my name on Facebook and hopefully if they're posting videos uh, get them added to this ever-growing community man because it's the, the amount of information being shared uh, models being built ideas being traded it's fantastic to say I'm loving it's an understatement really good people who knew there were that many left in the world? <laughs> there is hope for humanity. Hope you guys have a good weekend. It's Friday. May the glue and styrene just fall into place for you this weekend. That's my little wish for all of us. So, yep. Yeah. Hey, and to join in on uh, Frankie Day's Battle of Great Britain build. Uh, I think he's given until the end of the month to get it done so if you hadn't heard about it and you're up to it I know he'd appreciate more eye candy to look at and I know I would too that's it guys have a good weekend bye